Some mythical creatures exist or existing. Hi, I'm Mason Ramon and welcome to Real Life Mythical Creatures. A lot of these creatures on this list are mythical creatures or cryptids. Let's get this creature feature started. Dragons The Megalania is not a dragon with wings and breathes fire. Megalania is a giant type of Komodo dragon that lived up to the late Pleistocene epoch. Megalania was 23 feet long and weighing nearly two and a half tons. Megalania has a poisonous saliva that can cause blood thinning to kill its prey. Kraken. The Kraken might have been observations of a giant squid. The Kraken is also depicted to have sharp spikes on its suckers. The Kraken can grow up to 40 to 50 feet in length. The Kraken would use those huge spikes on its suckers to attack or defend itself from being attacked by a sperm whale. Basilisks. Basilisks are found in Central and South American rainforests, and they do not look like giant chickens with lizard tails and dragon wings. These lizards can run 7 miles an hour, and they are excellent climbers. These lizards are nicknamed Jesus Christ lizards because they can run on water. They literally run on water. Female basilisks can lay 4 clutches of 10 to 20 eggs per year, and they only take 3 months to hatch. Dracula. Vlad III was the Prince of Wallachia, and he was a member of the House of the Draculesti. He was called Vlad the Impaler because he would take victims to his torture chamber and impale them with his sword. After the victims died, he would drink the blood that was pouring out of the victims. Vlad the Impaler didn't have sharp teeth, but it's demonic enough that he kills and drinks the blood of his victims. Moby Dick. The novel Moby Dick was partially inspired by the real creature called Mocha Dick. Mocha Dick was a large white male sperm whale that lived in the Pacific Ocean. Sailors would usually encounter Mocha Dick near the island of Mocha off of southern Chile. Mocha Dick survived many attacks from whalers before he was eventually killed. His body was over 70 feet long and his head was covered in barnacles. Mocha Dick was killed in 1838 by Jeremiah Reynolds. Megalodon The Megalodon was a giant carnivorous shark that lived during the early Miocene to the late Pliocene epoch, 23 to 2.5 million years ago. Although Megalodon did exist at the time, but many people believe that Megalodon are still around. Videos on YouTube show that megalodon carcasses wash up on shore, but those videos are fake. Many others believe that megalodon became extinct over a million years ago. Loch Ness Monster The plesiosaur family is a very close resemblance to the Loch Ness Monster. Elasmosaurus lived in the late Cretaceous period, measuring up to 46 feet in length. Elasmosaurus would come up to the surface of the water for easy prey, arcing its neck. The Loch Ness Monster may be a long-surviving plesiosaur that survived the extinction. Unicorns This type of unicorn is not a white horse with a curly horn on it. This unicorn is called Elasmotherium also known as the giant Siberian unicorn. Elasmotherium is a type of woolly rhino that has a giant horn on its forehead, hence the name giant Siberian unicorn. Elasmotherium was 16 feet long and it weighed four and a half to five tons. It died out nearly 29,000 years ago. Cyclops. Yes, Cyclops did exist, but not how mythologists picture them. Dinotherium is a type of prehistoric elephant that looks like a modern elephant. Its tusks are curved down from its chin. This monster is 13 feet tall and it weighs 12 tons. 
If you look at the skull of a Dinotherium, you can see that it has some kind of eye structure on its forehead, meaning that is the look of a Cyclops. Mokalim Abembe Mokalim Abembe is a dino cryptid that has been believed to have survived various extinctions. Many people believe that it is the appearance of a sauropod. However, Mokalim Abembe's kind did exist. The Brontosaurus was a 70-foot giant that lived in the Jurassic period, and it would dwell in submerged in water to cool down from the intense Jurassic heat. Wendigo. The Wendigo is a monster that feeds on the blood and flesh of human beings. It is a humanoid creature with a deer head and back with long, slender arms and hooves, and its ribcage looks to be ripped to the bone. The Wendigo actually exists, unfortunately. In 1972, there was a plane crash in the Andes Mountains. The plane carried over 40 passengers, but 30 of them survived. The survivors had little food and very little heat, and they had no choice but to consume the dead passengers who were their classmates and friends. The Wendigo has to deal with cannibalism and mental health. Griffins. Griffins are half lion, half eagle. These griffins are not the ones you think. Protoceratops skeletons kind of resemble a griffin, except it doesn't have wings. Looking at its skull, the beak looks like as if it was a bird. Its front legs, as if they were eagle legs. And the hind legs are thicker than the forelimbs, and they are thick as lion legs. Hydras. In mythology, hydras are giant serpent-like creatures that has five to nine heads. If one head gets cut off, it regenerates two to replace it. This hydra is way smaller than what you expected. Hydras are freshwater organisms that are native to temperate or tropical regions. Hydras can grow up to 10 millimeters. Scientists call these organisms hydrids because of their regenerative ability. These hydras never tend to age or die. Dire Wolves the dire wolf is an extinct species of the genus called Canis. It was in fact one of the most famous predators of the Pleistocene epoch, along with its feline competitor, Smilodon. Dire wolves are much larger and stronger than today's gray wolf. Dire wolves can weigh up to 150 pounds. Iliamna Lake Monster The Iliamna Lake Monster is real. The white sturgeon is one of the largest freshwater fish in North America. White sturgeon is the third largest in the sturgeon family. This great fish's maximum size can be up to 1,799 pounds and 20 feet long. Werewolf once in a full moon, the werewolf would come out at night and murder innocent lives. A famous werewolf case was Peter Stump. He was a wealthy farmer who was accused of murder, cannibalism, and a werewolf in Rhineland. It all started with dead cattle and bodies of townsfolk were scattered all over the fields. The people thought that it was a wolf or a pack of wolves that attacked. In 1589, a hunting party was going on, and the hunting hounds had cornered the wolf. But it was not a wolf at all. It was Stump. The hunting party notices that one of Stump's hands had been bit off. Stump had confessed that he was a werewolf, and he was sentenced to one of the most painful deaths. Chupacabra. The first sighting of a chupacabra was in March of 1995. The chupacabra was described to have grayish-green skin with sharp fangs and it sucked on the blood from goats. Real chupacabras are actually dogs with a disease that causes hair loss and they would attack goats and drink the blood from goats. Imugi The Imugi is an ancient Korean legend. An Imugi is said to be a giant serpent-like dragon. The Imugi was discovered in Colombia and it's called Titana Bola. This huge snake lived for 12 million years after the dinosaurs died out. This snake measured to be 42 feet in length and it weighs over a ton. 
Titanoboa can swallow crocodiles whole without bulging its throat. Goblin Shark Goblin sharks are a rare species of deep sea shark. Many people call this shark a living fossil. This 14 foot long shark has a long snout and it can shift its mouth outward to catch prey with those prominent needle shark teeth. Giant Centipede My Lord Bag of Rice is a Japanese fairy tale about a warrior named Fujiwara no Haidesato who was sent on a quest to kill a giant centipede. This centipede existed over 300 million years ago. Arthropleura was a giant centipede that is over 10 feet long. Arthropleura consumed on plants, but its nasty jaws could deliver a powerful bite. If Arthropleura was still around today, it could rear up tall enough to look you right in the eye. Mapinguari the Mapinguari is a giant cyclops monster with its mouth on its belly. Mapinguari was a real creature. This Mapinguari is called Megatherium. Megatherium is a giant hairy ground sloth. Megatherium weighs 4 tons and is 20 feet long. And it's the largest known ground sloth. Adult Megatherium were almost indestructible. The Beast of Dean the Beast of Dean was a giant monster boar that lived in the forest of Dean. Wild boars are giant and dangerous pigs that are domestic in Eurasia and invasive to the US. The largest wild boar recorded was Hogzilla. Hogzilla is a hybrid between a wild boar and a farm pig. He was a 12 foot 300 pound monster that was killed in 2004. There was a second giant boar named Monster Pig. This giant boar was 9.4 feet long and it weighed 1,051 pounds. This monster pig was killed by an 11 year old boy named Jameson Stone. Mahamba Mahamba was rumored to lurk in the Lake Lucalia swamp region and it is purported to be a giant crocodile. If Mahamba was real, then its kind did exist millions of years ago. Dinosuchus is a giant crocodile that lived in the late Cretaceous period, 65 million years ago. The largest adults measure up to 35 feet in length and it weighs 3 tons. Dinosuchus would lurk in fresh water to ambush its prey. Thunderbirds Reports of Thunderbird sightings may have been going on for centuries and it was regarded as a myth. Thunderbirds did exist thousands of years ago. Argentavis was the largest flying bird ever to exist. Argentavis lived up to the late Miocene epoch. Argentavis had a wingspan of 23 feet and a weight of nearly 160 pounds. Argentavis was a magnificent bird of its time. Nagobo the Nagobu was another dinosaur cryptid that was first sighted in Africa in 1919. It was described to be 24 feet long, has two long horns on its head, a short horn on its snout, multiple horns on its crest, the front limbs of those of a horse, the hind limbs are cloven, and it has a hump on its back. Nagobu was a real creature. Styracosaurus has a similar description of Nagobu. Styracosaurus has six horns on its crest, a long horn on its snout, and it was 18 feet long, weighing nearly 3 tons. Any kind of ceratopsian fossil was never found in Africa. Most of them were found in North America, Europe, and Asia. The Bear Lake Monster The Bear Lake Monster was described to be a form of a sea serpent. Another description of this creature was said to be the form of a mosasaur. Mosasaurus did exist over 70 million years ago. The Mosasaurus is a 50 foot long monster bigger than a Tyrannosaurus Rex, and this nasty creature can eat sharks, turtles, pterosaurs, and other mosasaurs. Here are a few honorable mentions to this list. Not that they are real. These honorable mentions will tell you a description when they were first sighted and what the creature has done. Caesirex. 
The case Cyrex is a dinosaur cryptid that lives in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. It is depicted to be a theropod dinosaur, like a T-Rex or Allosaur. Others depicted it as a giant monitor lizard. In 1932, John Johnson and his servant were traveling in the Congo forest. During the journey, they encountered a rhinoceros. From the undergrowth, a huge theropod creature attacked the rhino. John Johnson had fainted, and his servant had ran away. As soon as Johnson recovered, he saw the creature eating the rhino. Johnson described that the K-Cyrex has a long snout filled with sharp teeth. Its body was a red color with dark stripes, and it had thick legs. There are two photographs of the K-Cyrex, one with a giant lizard on top of a rhino, and another with a theropod creature eating a rhino but both of those pictures are confirmed to be hoaxes. The Beast of Busco. Oscar Folk supposedly saw a giant turtle living in the seven acre lake on his farm near Churubusco. He told others about the turtle, but eventually Oscar decided to leave it alone. Half a century later in 1948, Two Churubusco citizens, Aura Blue and Charlie Wilson, also reported seeing a giant turtle, and they named it Oscar. Oscar weighs nearly 500 pounds. A farmer named Gail Harris owned the land at the time. Harris and the others also reported seeing the turtle. Word spread. In early 1949, a UPI reporter from Fort Wayne sent the story out on the wire services, and the turtle became nationally famous. Curious mobs of sightseers began to invade Harris's land. Traffic got so bad that the state police had to be called in for traffic control, but Oscar, the Beast of Busco, was never captured. Bigfoot Bigfoot is described as a large, hairy, muscular, bipedal, ape-like creature. Nearly seven to nine feet, Bigfoot is covered in hair, described in black, dark brown, or dark red. Individuals claiming to have seen Bigfoot describe large eyes and a large, low-set forehead. The top of the head has been described as rounded and crested, similar to the crest of the male gorilla, with a strong, unpleasant smell. The enormous footprints for which it had is named are claimed to be as large as 24 inches long and 8 inches wide. Most sightings of Bigfoot were seen in the northwest part of the U.S. Bigfoot has three cousins, the Yaoi who lives in Australia, the Yaren who lives in Mongolia, and the Yeti who lives up in the Himalayas. Mothman. On November 12, 1966, five men who were digging a grave at a cemetery near Clennon in West Virginia claimed to see a man-like figure fly low from the trees over their heads. This is often identified as the first known sighting of what became known as the Mothman. Shortly after, on November 15th, two young couples from Point Pleasant told police that they saw a large, white creature whose eyes glowed red when the car highlights picked it up. They described it as a large flying man with 10-foot wings, following their car when they were driving in an area outside of town. December 15, 1967, Silver Bridge collapsed and 46 people died. After the collapse, there were no further reports of Mothman sightings, giving rise to legends that the Mothman sightings and the bridge collapse were connected. Goatman According to urban legend, the Goatman is an axe-wielding half-animal, half-man creature who was once a scientist who worked in the Beltsville Agricultural Research Center. The tale holds that the scientist was experimenting on goats until one of his experiments backfired. The scientist was mutated into a human-goat hybrid. He then began attacking cars with an axe, roaming the back roads of Beltsville, Maryland. A variation of the legend tells of the goat man as an old hermit who lives in the woods, seen walking alone at night along Fletcher Town Road. Minotaur in Greek mythology, the Minotaur was a creature with the head of a bull and the body of a man. The Minotaur dwelt at the center of a labyrinth, which was an elaborate maze-like construction designed by the architect Daedalus and his son Icarus, and the command of King Minos of Crete. The Minotaur was eventually killed by the Athenian hero 
Theseus. Jersey Devil The Jersey Devil is a legendary cryptid said to inhabit the Pine Barrens of southern New Jersey. The creature is often described as a marsupial-like creature with the head of a goat, leathery bat wings, ram horns, small arms with clawed hands, cloven hooves, and a forked tail. It has been reported to have moved quickly and often is described as emitting a blood-curdling scream. Legend says that a mother had 12 children and after finding she was pregnant for the 13th time, she stated that this one would be the devil. In 1735, the mother was in labor on a stormy night while her friends gathered around her. The mother was supposedly a witch and the father was the devil himself. Being born as a normal child, it changed to a creature with hooves, a goat's head, bat wings, and a forked tail. Growling and screaming, it killed the mother before flying up the chimney, circling the village, and heading towards the pines. Emela Natalka The Emela Natalka is a legendary creature from the Lukwala region of Central Africa. Its name means Killer of the Elephants. In the Lingala language, the Emela Natalka would be the size of an African forest elephant. It would have a brownish gray color and it has a single horn and a long tail. For his heavy body, the Emela Natalka possibly needs strong muscular legs. The Emela Natalka possibly is a semi aquatic animal and it would feed on the Malambo plant. Krampus. In Austro Bavarian Alpine folklore, Krampus is a figure described as half goat, half demon. During the Christmas season, children with lack of Christmas spirit will unleash the wrath of Krampus. Krampus will punish children who have misbehaved themselves, in contrast with St. Nicholas who rewards the well-behaved children with gifts. Krampus would carry a large sack to carry the naughty children to their fates. Krampus would drown, eat, or transport the children to the depths of hell. Krampus doesn't give, Krampus takes away. Orochi. Orochi the Eight-Headed Dragon doesn't come from a Godzilla movie. Yamato no Orochi comes from Japanese mythology. Legend says that the Eight-Headed Dragon will come out and cause destruction to the world. All eight heads can breathe extremely hot fire. Orochi can only be stopped by a giant samurai. Killing Orochi is difficult. You have to cut off all eight of its heads for Orochi to die. Well, I hope you enjoyed this creepy creature cryptid video. Thank you guys for watching. If you want more videos like this, click the like button. Please subscribe to Mason Ramon.